Well, researchers say a local university will soon launch a program doing unprecedented scientific research just up the coast from here. That's right. Texas A&M Corpus Christi researchers are getting more than two and a half million dollars from the state for an extensive review of Matagorda Bay. And our Seth Kovar joins us now live from the newsroom. Seth, will the school benefit financially from this? Actually, no. All two point seven million dollars goes directly into the research. But Texas A&M Corpus Christi leaders say that there are other benefits for students, scientists, and the state. It's going to be a really fun project. Fun and important. Greg Stuns of TAMUCC's Heart Research Institute can't hide his excitement about the two-year project they're about to embark on, with $2.7 million in state funding behind them. Matagorda Bay is one of the iconic bays on the Texas coast, very important economically. A lot of shrimping, a lot of commercial fishing, and especially a lot of recreational fishing occurs there. But it's also environmentally sensitive. Researchers will use methods, like you'll see in this video they gave us, to monitor the balance between all of that activity and the habitat for endangered species like sea turtles. Extensive mapping of oyster beds, seagrass, and marshes will help them do it. We could identify real ecological hot spots that maybe you might want to avoid with activities like that so those industries can ex coexist and maximize the resources that that bay produces. And their research produces opportunities for A&M Corpus Christi students from PhDs down to undergrads to get a jump start on their futures. It's training the next generation of scientists, but this is a, a wonderful opportunity for students to get involved as they further their education. And you can benefit too, at least from an entertainment standpoint. You see they're going to be tagging sea turtles so they can be monitored from satellites. They're going to put that information online, a link to their movements, and you can watch along. They're even going to name those turtles so you can pick out your favorite. What do you think about that, Katya? How about a Seth turtle? That'd be pretty good. It would be a big, strong turtle. <laughs> Thanks, Seth. And researchers from A&M's flagship university and college station and from the Galveston branch will work with TAMU-CC on this project.